All right, we're here on the dashboard of copy.ai. It's a really simple and easy to use user interface. That is something that I do like about this AI copywriter. Also, there's not a whole lot of extra bells and whistles, which just really helps keep the user experience easy, uh, keeps the, the learning curve short. And right here is where all of your projects will show up. And all a project is essentially is a Google Doc. Um, here on the left hand side is the uh, content generation template. Uh, so this specific one is um, would generate a description for a product. And then you can edit the, the generated text here on the right hand side of the screen and then save it. So that would be a project. And going back to the main dashboard here um, on the left hand side, that's where you'll find all of the templates. Now, like I mentioned, Copy.ai has over 90 different templates. That is something that is unique about them. Most other AI writers only have between 50 and 70. And although that is usually plenty uh, to be able to gen generate whatever you want to generate, um, when you do have 90 templates, you will find some additional ones in here that you won't be able to find elsewhere, such as their motivational quote content generator, as well as the short story one as well. Now, the short story template uh, with copy.ai, it will generate close to a one page um, short story, whereas most other story generators out there, um, they'll only generate roughly a paragraph or two. Um, so being able to generate a full one pager is something else that is unique with copy.ai. As far as pricing goes, Copy.ai is really unique in the fact that they provide you with 2,000 words for free every single month. It's very rare to find another AI writer that will do this, especially one that generates content um, similar to the quality of Copy.ai. Um, so with their free plan, you get those 2,000 words per month, as well as access to their 90 plus copywriting tools. Uh, you can create unlimited projects and also try their pro plan uh, free for seven days. Now, 2000 words is only enough to generate roughly one or two blog posts. So it's not a whole lot. If you're gonna be generating more content than that, um, their pro plan starts at $49 a month and that is for 40,000 words. And the next level up there is 100,000 words for $99 a month. And this is the same price as Jasper.ai. Um, if you haven't already tried Jasper, I would recommend trying them. Um, you can start a free trial with Jasper and get 10,000 words for free by using the link in the description of this video. Um, personally, I do feel like Jasper creates a little bit better content, uh, but that is just my opinion. Uh, I do recommend trying them both out. So also with the copy.ai pro plan, um, you get five user seats. So if you have a small team, uh, this would be the way to go. Also, um, you can generate in over 25 languages and you have access to the blog wizard tool, which is exactly what we're gonna go ahead and try out right now. All right, we're here on the blog post wizard template for copy.ai. And we're just gonna go ahead and start by um, testing it out with a really simple prompt how to make the perfect cheese pizza. And our keywords will be cheese pizza, pizza, good enough. And we'll change the tone of voice to witty. Now, whenever I'm testing out a new AI writer, I always like to provide it with a really simple prompt to start out with. Um, just that way, as I'm reviewing the content, uh, I don't get caught up on any kind of factual details or anything like that. Um, this just allows me to, um, to review the overall creativity and quality of the content generated. So uh, this here is the outline that Copy AI came up with. Uh, we've got make the dough, preheat the oven, prepare the pizza pan and toppings, shape the crust, um, pre-bake the crust. Um, it goes on, talk about adding the sauce, 
the cheese, um, things like that. And it will be generating an intro paragraph as well as a conclusion paragraph. Um, you know, if I was actually going to be publishing this article right here, I would probably arrange um, a few of these um, outline points a little bit different and make some edits, but that's not the case right now. Um, we're just kind of reviewing what copy.ai comes up with. So I'm going to um, get rid of a few of these just that way we have a few less to review. And then I'm going to move on to generate the talking points. Now, what this does is it basically comes up with the, um, uh, just for like subsections within each um, point of the article outline. And let's see here. So I'm just going to go ahead and generate the content for the blog article now. Let's see what it comes up with. All right, for the introduction, we have, I don't know about you, but when I get home from a long day of work, nothing sounds better than a slice or two of pizza. It's quick and easy to make. It doesn't require much in the way of preparation, and it's delicious. The only problem is that sometimes your friends and family are like, I want cheese pizza, or no, pepperoni for me, but there's no reason why you can't make them both happy. Uh, you know, that's not, that's not too bad. That's a fairly creative um, introduction paragraph. We, um, you know, so if you were actually gen generating an article that you would publish, um, you know, you probably would have rearranged a few of the outline points a second ago. I didn't do that. So you can kind of tell that um, it's not exactly in order here. Um, you know, it's talking about adding the cheese at the end of the article when I, feel like that should be more towards the beginning of, of making a pizza. Um, but that's kind of not too relevant as far as the creativity goes, you know, I'm, I'm fairly impressed with the creativity of copy.ai. Um, it doesn't sound like a robot has been writing this content, although it's not very, uh, impressive either. <laughs> um, it, it, it doesn't sound robotic and that's kind of one of the important parts here. All right, this is the short story template for copy.ai. It's a template built on top of their freestyle mode. And the freestyle mode is similar to boss mode in Jasper. And the and building a template in freestyle is kind of like building a recipe in Jasper. Um, so as far as the short story goes, we can add in a genre. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and test it out right now with the genre and I'm just going to put in, um, nonfiction and for the theme, I'm going to do an accountant who quits his job to travel the world. And I like how they suggest that you can include a plot twist. So I'm, I'm actually going to leave that in here include a plot twist and for the tone of voice, I'm going to change it to adventurous and see what copy.ai comes up with. All right. For the short story, this is what we got here. The accountant had always been a cautious man. He didn't like to take risk and he never left his house without checking the weather report first. But then one day something happened that changed everything for him. He was at work when he heard someone screaming outside. He ran to see what was wrong and found a group of people gathered around a young boy who had fallen into a river while skipping rocks. The accountant jumped in without thinking twice and pulled the boy to safety uh, before anything, but before any harm could come to him. All right, that's a pretty intriguing intro there. Um, when one word got out about what had happened, people started coming up with ideas for how they could reward the accountant for his bravery. Some suggested giving him a medal or making him mayor of their town, but others wanted something more special. They wanted him to quit his job as an accountant so he could travel the world. The accountant thought this over carefully uh, before deciding that, yes, it would be nice to see more of the world before he died. Uh, though he had never actually considered that possibility. So he did just that. He packed up all of his belongings and set off on an adventure. 
Wow. No, that's actually not bad at all. Um, I had no idea where it was going there at first when it was talking about him jumping into the river. Um, but that was definitely a, a very complete story in just a few paragraphs. So um, as far as creativity goes, um, great job for copy.ai. Um, you know, I'm fairly impressed with this little short story. Um, but yeah, no, that, that's another great template included with the software. Um, let's go ahead and check out one more template really quickly. Let's go ahead and look at the motivational quote template. All right, the motivational quote template is also built on top of the freestyle mode. And all you do is just put in a topic to generate the quotes on. And ours will be starting a business is difficult but worth it if you work hard. And let's see what we got for the tone of voice. We'll do, um, let's go with bold. All right, let's see what we got here. It's time to get down to business. Starting a business is hard, but it's worth it if you work hard. We have all the tools you need to get started and make sure that your business is successful. We can help you create a brand, design a website and logo, build an app, you name it. All right, sounds pretty good. Sounds like a slogan. So, you know, that's pretty good. Um, <laughs> you know, it's uh, it's not the most inspirational uh, text I've ever read.